Hey guys, and welcome to a new Let's Play. This is a game that I have wanted to play for a good amount of time now. Um, I've actually only played this one once. It is a game, of course, that needs no introduction. Uh, the Last of Us. Some people think it's the second coming of Jesus. Um, one of the most grandeur legendary games of all time yeah I mean the story's good but <laughs> let's not go nuts now however however it is a good game and uh, it's one that really took me by surprise now when I first got my PlayStation 4 when they first came out and this came out for it this game visually blew me away um, the story was amazing it was really human really engaging really good characters you know as we come to expect from uh, Naughty Dog but this pushed things a little bit further so I enjoyed it I enjoyed it a lot and I also like the fact that it runs 60 FPS I really like the fact that it runs 60 FPS which is nice to see some, you know, actual tangible upgrades. Just, uh, you know, not just sharpen the game up, but actually make it run and play nicer. Now, the gameplay, eh, it's okay. It hasn't aged um, as well as the story. I mean, it's still good, don't get me wrong, it's still very good. But, it, yeah, there's a little bit of crust starting to appear, I think. There's a little bit of uh, paint peeling, shall we say. Um... But I am going to play it again. I haven't played it since PlayStation 4 came out. I mean, I've played it a little bit just to get up to speed on it again, but nothing major. Anyway, we are going to go into it. The story in this game is what makes it, I think. And the soundtrack, guys, the soundtrack is incredible. Now, has this game held up over the last... When did this game even come out? I don't know. 2012, maybe? Has this game still held up? I don't know. But let's find out. Uh, we're going to go new game. We're going to go normal. Uh, I've finished this game on hard and normal, I believe. But uh, I'm going to go for normal. Because I like finding supplies. And I like, you know, actually enjoying the weapons and stuff. I don't like running through a game with like two bullets and, you know, instant death. That's not fun for me. So we're going to go normal. And we're going to go new save data. Playing this on the PS4 Pro as well, where originally I, of course, played it on my uh, standard PlayStation 4. I'm very happy with how it ran as well. Now, this is a zombie game. Um, that's not exactly a spoiler. I mean, you shouldn't really worry too much about spoilers in this game anyway. It is, like, nearly a decade old. That's scary. Um, it is a zombie game, but they went for a kind of interesting and semi-unique angle, and it's really quite good how it's done. And there's some amazing character development as well. Tommy, listen to me. He is the contractor. He's the contractor, okay? I can't lose this job. I, I understand. Let, let's talk about this in the morning, okay? Just, we'll talk about it in the morning. <laughs> All right, good night. Hey. Scoot. Monday at work, huh? What are you still doing up? It's late. Crud, what time is it? It's way past your bedtime. But it's still today. Honey, please not right now. I do not have the energy for this. Here. What's this? Your birthday? You kept complaining about your broken watch. So, I uh, figured, you know. You like it? 
I think this is it's what? nice, but I I think it's stuck. It's not What no 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 no. Oh ha ha. Where did you get the money for this? Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. Oh good. We started helping out with the mortgage then. Yeah, you wish. Uncle Tommy, what time is it? I need to talk to your dad now. There's something. Uh, Uncle Tommy? Hello? And here we go. This is where we actually start the game proper and take control. Well, I say start the game proper. Not quite, but there's a nice little build up to the start of this game and it's really good. Uh, there's a few things in here that we can interact with. So let's have a little look, shall we? Hmm. Phone's dead. Phone's dead. How bizarre. So what have we got here? Dawn of the Wolf. Mm-hmm. I see. Okay. Lots of photos around. Very nice, very nice, very nice mirror there. Okay. The Bash. Huh? Never heard of them. Probably not my sort of thing, to be honest. What else have we got laying around here as we explore? Oh, dang it. To give this Sarah's room. <laughs> I, actually, I actually really like that. That's quite a cool card. Dear Dad, let's see. You're never around. You have the music. Oh, you hate the music I'm into. You practically. Oh, man. I wish we could get some light on that thing. Seriously? Why? That's a bit dark, isn't it? Crazy. Uh, you're never around. You practically despise. Oh, the bands I like? I don't know. And yet, somehow, you still manage to be the best dad every year. How do you do that? Smiley face. Happy birthday, Pops. Love, Sarah. Aw. You're not a fossil yet. I like that. That's cool. So, yeah. Um, daddy and daughter have a very good relationship. It's all good. It's all gravy. No broken homes here. So, yeah, it looks like she's a bit of a skater as well. Okay. Bit of a tomboy. I see. All right, anyway, let's get out of here. Let's go find Daddy. Because Dad? uh, someone called Tommy's on the phone. Where would Dad be? I mean, what was the time? Can we even see what the time is? Now, I must say, the graphics have definitely aging. Oh, these star, these glow-in-the-dark stars, you know? I used to have those in my bedroom as well like when I was a kid. Man, that was a blast in the past. You know, I don't... Yeah, they were stars, and there were other shapes as well. Daddy? Hmm. Where's Dad? It's a little bit strange. Where is he at this hour? You in here? Seems to be somehow connected to the nationwide Where the pandemic. heck are you? We've received reports that victims afflicted with the infection show signs of increased aggression. It's nearby. Aggression and... everybody out of here now. This is ghastly. There seems to be some commotion coming from the... Whoa. Huh. Okay, there's a gas leak. Well, I don't know what the hell's going on, but... Uh, yeah, let's hope the emergency services get that sorted as quick as they possibly can. Let's check out Dad's room. What's Dad got? He's got a bottle of pills. Some tissues by the bed. Let's not, let's not think about that too hard. Looks like he's got an ensuite. He plays the guitar as well. Very important thing to know about Dad. He likes the guitar. Yeah, that may be important later on. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice. Well, he's leaving this uh, in a bit of a state, but hey. 
He's obviously working very hard. Dad? So, things are not all good in the neighbourhood. Let's just uh, say that. I don't know. This house... Oh, hell. Well, I suppose if things are exploding, that's nothing out of the ordinary, is it? Um, hmm. Actually, there is one little bit of flavour that we have missed, I think. Sure. Go into this room back here. We can't... Oh, no, we can move a little bit faster, but not much. Ah, the most important house... Oh, the most important room in the house. The throne. Let's have a little look, shall we? Hmm. Admittant spikes at area hospitals. 300% increase due to mysterious infection. FDA explains list... Uh, contaminated crops, massive recalls anticipated. Police, crazed woman, killed husband, three others. Hmm, three hundred percent increase in infections. Interesting. Just what the hell is going on around here? We've got the neighbourhood exploding. There's infections, products, and crops recalled. Hmm. Yep. There's the acoustic. Look at the size of this house as well. It's huge, man. I do like this open plan design. Very nice. Hmm. Oh, hello. There's this phone. Hmm. I remember this phone as well. Eight is called. Who the hell are you? Call me on my way. So it's quarter past two in the morning. Damn. I'd still be up. Well. Looks like Fido just either got himself a snack or became a snack. Hmm. Let's keep looking for Dad. Oh, well, there's Dad. Here you are, sir. Are you okay? Yeah. Did anyone come in here? No. Who would come in here? Don't go near the doors. Just, just stand back there. Dad, you're kind of freaking me out. What's going on? It's the Coopers. Something ain't right with them. I think they're sick. What kind of sick? <gasps> um, that kind. Jimmy! Dad? Honey, come here. Come here. Jimmy! <laughs> Jimmy, I am warning you! Oh Don't! <laughs> This morning. Sammy, there is something bad going on. And we have got to get out of here. Do you understand me? Yeah. Tell me, come on. Come on. Where the hell have you been? You have any idea what's going on out there? I got some notion. Holy shit. You got blood all over you. Hey, mind. Let's just get out of here. You're saying half the people in the city lost their mind. Can we just please go? Some sort of parasite or something. You gonna tell me what happened? Later. Hey, Sarah. How you holding up, honey? I'm fine. Can we hear us on the radio? Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. No cell phone. No radio. Yeah, we're doing great. A minute ago, newsman wouldn't shut up. He said where to go. They said, uh, Army's putting up roadblocks on the highway. No getting into Travis County. So we need to get the hell out. Take the 71. 70, that's right. Did they say how many are dead? Probably a lot. Found this one family all mangled inside their Tommy. house. Right. I'm sorry. Jesus Christ, how did this happen? They got no clue. But we ain't the only town. The first they're saying it's just the south. Lewis's farm. I hope that son of a bitch made it out. I'm sure he did. Are we sick? No, of course not. How do you know? They said it's just uh, people in the city. We're good. Didn't Jimmy work in the city? 
That's right, he did. Fine, trust me. All right. Let's see what they need. What do you think you're doing? Keep driving. I got a kid, Joe. So do we. But we have room. Hey, Keep hey, driving, stop. Tommy. Stop! I can't see what I see. Someone else will come along. You should have helped him. Mother had the same damn idea. We could just backtrack and. Hey, what the fuck, man? Let's go! Tommy! Tommy! Holy shit! Can't stop here, Tommy. I can't fucking drive through them, Joe. Back up there. They're behind me too. <laughs> there, there, there. Hold on. Go. Wow, this is still gripping me, guys. This is good. What an opening. How could this day get worse? I wonder. Oh, there certainly is chaos on them streets. Oh hell. Hey fella. <laughs> Ooh, ah, brick to the chops. Come here, baby. Come here, come give me your hand. What is it? My leg hurts. How bad? Look out, there's another one! We're gonna need to run. Keep us safe. Right, let's get the hell out of here. Hold on tight. Well, uh, I guess we're gonna follow the masses. I hope you're good with that gun, Tommy. Oh, shit. Get your ass close, honey. Ooh. 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 Damn, these guys are getting savaged. Whoa. Lit that place up like the Fourth of July. Man. Don't look, sir. Yeah. Well. To be honest, burning to death, maybe, maybe not so bad. Whoa. Considering. I've seen the future. Keep looking at me, baby. It's not great. Well, I guess we're not going to the cinema. Um, yeah. Come on, Tommy. Open the door. Yeah. Open the door, dude. Go. There are crazy people. Definitely not zombies. Whoa, hello. Cheers, Tommy. Ooh. Good night, sweetheart. Good night. Right, okay. Ooh. Hey, fellas. Not good. Not good. Not good. Move it. Come on. Get to the highway. What? Go. You got Sarah. I can outrun him. Uncle Tommy. I will meet you there. Hurry. Right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, I'm he's sure he's gonna be fine. I hope. Oof. I guess we've only got one way to go. Damn it, we got someone following us. Yeah, I know, Sarah, I know. Um, how the fuck did that get here? Oh, shit. Must keep moving, must keep moving. Oh, we're so close. Oof. It's okay, baby, we're safe. We're safe. Hey, we 
We need help. Stop! Please. It's my daughter. Please. I think her leg is broken. Stop right there! Okay. We're not sick. Got a couple of civilians on the outer perimeter. Please advise. Eddie, what about Uncle Tommy? We're gonna get you to safety and go back for him, okay? Sir, there's a little girl. But... Yes, sir. Somebody we've just been through hell. Okay, we just need... Okay, baby, stay with me. I want to pick you up. I know, baby. I know it hurts. Come on, baby, please. I know, baby. I know. Sarah. Baby. Don't do this to me, baby. Don't do this to me, baby. Come on. That is so savage, man. And what really helps is the acting. It's so good. The number of confirmed deaths has passed 200. The governor has called a state of emergency. There are hundreds and hundreds of bodies lining the streets. Panic spread worldwide after a leaked report from the World Health Organization showed that the latest vaccination tests have failed. With the bureaucrats out of power, we can finally take the necessary steps. Los Angeles is now the latest city to be placed under martial law. All residents are required to report to their designated quarantine. Riots have continued for a third consecutive day, and winter rations are at an all-time low. A group calling themselves the Fireflies have claimed responsibility for both attacks. Their public charter calls for the return of all branches of government. Demonstrations broke out following the execution of six more alleged Fireflies. Remember, when you're lost in the darkness, look for the light. Believe in the fireflies. I'm coming. <clears throat> How was your morning? Want one? No, I don't want one. Well, I have some interesting news for you. Where were you, Tess? West End District. Hey, we had a drop to make. We. We had a drop to make. Well, you wanted to be left alone, remember? So I'll take one guess. The uh, whole deal went south and the client made off with our pills. Is that about <laughs> right? The deal went off without a hitch. Enough ration cards to last us a couple of months. Easy. You want to explain this? I was on my way back here and I got jumped by these two assholes, all right? Yeah, they got a few good hits in, but... Look, I managed. Yeah, give me that. Are these assholes still with us? <laughs> well, that's funny. Let's find out who they were. Yeah, look, they were a couple of nobodies. They don't matter. What matters is that Robert fucking sent them. Our Robert. He knows that we're after him. He figures he's gonna get us first. Son of a bitch, he's smart. He's not smart enough. I know where he's hiding. Like hell you do. Old warehouse in Area 5. Can't say for how long, though. Well, I'm ready now, yeah? Well, I can do now.
Checkpoint's still open. Only got a few hours left until curfew. Well, we better hurry up then. Hmm, we better hurry up indeed. However, I think that's going to have to wait for next time. Sadly, I don't know when next time is going to be because uh, still in the transitional um, time at the moment when I'm moving to a new place. Uh, yeah, so hopefully I'm going to record some more of this. I was supposed to record some of this yesterday, um, but we had a kind of a big mix up of things and that didn't go to plan but anyway that's irrelevant i hope you've enjoyed this so far a quick look uh, i'm going to look at the footage see how it came out i haven't actually recorded a video for seven or eight weeks so i'm a little bit rusty but oh oh has it felt good to be back behind the microphone um when we return we're going to follow our friend Tess here and start looking for a man named Robert. Hmm. Interesting. So, thanks for watching, everyone. As always, till next time.